So louder, faster, what else? Higher, right? Like you guys pretty much did on your solo, right? Both of you started lower and worked up higher. That works. Long notes can be great when you're when you're playing together, right? One of you just sitting on a long note, that builds some tension. Mm -hmm. Two of you sitting on a long note, going up, and then, you know. Playing chords. Yes, exactly. <laughs> and, uh, but I, I feel like um, when you start trading, you just gotta be all in. Okay. You know, you're a little bit too conservative. You're a little too. That's true. Pardon? I said that's true, yeah. So, you know, what, what happens on a battle is you're trying to up each other's game, right? The best I ever saw, I think, uh, with Marsalis with Riley Maherker who was a trumpet player at um, Garfield. And Witten Marsalis could have demolished him, of course, a high school kid, right? But he didn't do that. They were trading, it's on this tune called Black and Tan Fantasy, Avery Fisher Hall. I think there's a video on YouTube. And Witten would just play a little bit better than Riley, each time. He didn't cut him. He encouraged him to reach beyond what he could do by himself, right? So Riley, felt like, okay, I'm, 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 I have to go for it. And then Winton would push him a little bit more. And Riley went for it, and Ron, Winton would push him more, and he could just feel the excitement extending beyond what any one person could do by himself. It was beyond what Riley could do by himself because he was bouncing off. That's the best scenario, right? Ryan plays his best, and then maybe not his best, right? You're going to save your best for a little later. But he's going to lay out something really great, and Seth is going to go, okay... How about this? And then Ryan's gonna go, oh really? And he's gonna go, and Seth's gonna go, ah! <laughs> and then he's gonna, ah! you know what I mean? Yeah. That's the best, rather than sort of this more conservative approach. Yeah. Push each other. What? It'll be an ironic laugh contest, like what you just did. You go, ha 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 ha, and then he goes, ha 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 ha, and I go ahead and do it the louder. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you just said, and I'm literally just saying what you said. Great, great. Yeah. I'm embarrassed that I said it. Yeah, it was fine. If that's what it sounded like. Yeah. It was good. It made sense. Well, it sounded like an ironic Okay. Uh, and, and I think, did you hear what I was saying on yours? Like, you just go as long as you want. It depends on your chops. It depends. You know, I, I'm not, I don't know you as a soloist that well yet, so I don't know how far you're, you're going to go. But when you're done, and we can't have, they don't have visual contact with you, make it clear that you're done. And especially um, Gabby. And like I told Gabby, if you're not done, make that clear too, right? Because Gabby's going to be paying attention. He listens pretty well. So he's going to be paying attention. And if it's the end of it, he's going to bring the dynamic down. If it's not the end, he's going to keep it going around the corner, so to speak. So don't fake him out. Don't be like, oh, yeah, this is the end. And so he brings it down. And you're like, but I'm going to keep playing. You know what I mean? Okay. Question, Braden? No. Okay. Walking thing? One, two, go oh, on, two, three. Thank you. 